Hey guys, it's Andrew here with Cyber Review. Welcome back. So today I'm going to show you guys how to set up some really nice lighting for either video or photography, whatever you do. I know a lot of you are fellow YouTubers out there and maybe you don't want to spend a lot on lighting such as myself. I try to use as much natural light as I can and I've actually just been using just a shop light that you'd normally see at like a construction site or something like that. So this here is a simple way that you can set up some lighting. All we're going to be using is some PVC pipe, some simple kind of shop lights that you can pick up at just your local store, and uh, some shower caps, which is kind of funny. Uh, but all this is going to cost under $30, and you'll get a nice lighting setup. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alright guys, so here's everything that we're going to need. We're going to need some PVC pipe. I'm using half inch PVC pipe. You can get three quarter inch and that'll make it a little sturdier, but I'm using half inch. And then I'm also using some half inch uh, PVC fittings. I have eight T's and then I have just two couplings. And then I've got these two shop lights. Now a lot of you may kind of recognize these from your store. You can pick these up at your local hardware store or uh, a lot of bigger stores will have these as well. So you're gonna need two of these and then you're also gonna need a couple uh, shower caps. And the shower caps are to put over this so that the light is filtered through. Now your setup could be different from mine. Uh, you can add PVC pipe, you can take it away. That's the nice thing about this setup is it depends on your situation. You can make it taller or, you know, kind of mess around with it, play around and see what works for you. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and put this together. I'm going to fast forward through it so you guys can just see how it's done and get the basic idea because, like I said, you can really put this together however you like. Um, you are going to need either a pipe cutter or a saw just so you can get the correct lengths on your PVC pipe. So let's go ahead and get this set up. Now I got all my PVC pipe pre-cut to two foot pieces. The only cuts I needed to make were for the feet, so I cut out two 10 inch pieces and four seven inch pieces, and that's what's gonna make up the base of one of my stands. So as you can see here, I have them cut and ready to go. So now we're gonna jump into the assembly, and I went ahead and fast forward through that, but you guys can get a good idea of how it's done. So to start, I assembled the base of the stand. I took the two 10 inch pieces and the four seven inch pieces to make the stand, and then I attached the two two foot sections to make the upright. Now, when you put the light on, make sure you don't use a very high wattage light. I'm using a 13 watt light, so it's not gonna melt the shower cap that goes over it. All right guys, here's the finished product here, and I did go ahead and spray paint it. It made it look a lot nicer. Now remember, I made two stands, and the cost for both stands was under $30. It cost me about $28.50 to make both stands. It's a very good value and I would highly recommend doing this if you're looking for a cheap lighting solution. All right guys, so now it's time for a demonstration of the lights we just put together. So right now, they're turned off. They're just outside of uh, camera range. There's, you can see both of them there on either side of me and I don't have them on. So right now the only light is the lights that's kind of coming through my blinds they are closed and that's the only light in the room so you can see i got shadows behind me and uh, i'm just really a, a lot harder to see than i would be with lights as you'll find out in a second so now i'm going to turn on uh, one light at a time so you guys can see how it looks let's go ahead and got this one on now now you can see the side of my face is obviously lit up quite a bit more i have a harsher shadow now in the background but when we turn on this light here, as you can see, the shadows are a lot subtler in the background and I am coming in bright and clear. You guys can see me a lot better and this works great. So now I wanna show you one other thing. I'm gonna take off the shower caps that are on them and show you guys how the light is uh, just a lot harsher without those shower caps to filter it. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull it off this one here and got that one off and we'll pull it off this one and now as you can see the shadows in the background are a lot more prominent now and the light is actually blinding me um, on either side of me it's so the lighting's a lot harsher so with the shower caps on them um, that it just I mean it filters the light just how a light box does 
and it works great. So there's just a little demonstration, guys, so you get an idea of how well this setup does work. All right, well that does it for my video of DIY lighting for under $30. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's something I normally don't do, but I thought this was such a cool lighting solution, I wanted to share it with you guys. Now remember, you guys don't have to make the exact same stand I did. All you need is some PVC pipe, a light, and a shower cap, and you can design the stand however you would like. If you guys liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more upcoming videos, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.